Yeah, I'm Guy McLean. I'm the director here at the Westfield Athenaeum, and we're here in the uh, brand new history exhibit that we are opening uh, now. Uh, and we have some interesting artifacts to talk about. And the one I want to talk about uh, in this section uh, is uh, the Fowley musket that you see above me in the case. Uh, this is a very important artifact. Uh, Fowley was a, a man who made weapons here in Westfield uh, in the 1780s and 1790s. And the importance of this particular musket was this musket was used uh, as the model or as the prototype uh, for the first U.S. Army produced rifles uh, were made in Springfield just down the road. Uh, George Washington established the Springfield Armory in the 1790s and it became a major production center for uh, American military rifles. Uh, it was very, very important during the Civil War. The, the rifles made at the Springfield Armory were very important in helping Northern forces win that war. And then later on in the 20th century, the famous 1903 Springfield rifle was used during World War I. And then probably the most famous rifle ever made uh, was the M1 rifle developed by Garand, John Garand, uh, at the Armory in the 1930s, and it was the rifle used during World War II. And many ri uh, uh, gun e uh, experts have said that the M1 rifle uh, was the most famous, the most successful rifle ever made. These were all made at the Springfield Armory, but it started with the Fowley musket uh, made by a Westfield resident here. Uh, his rifle was considered of very high quality, and so uh, the, the people at the Springfield Armory, when they first were starting and looking for a good rifle to use as a prototype, they chose the Fowley musket. So hopefully you can come down uh, to the Westfield Athenaeum and see this brand new exhibit and see this very important artifact, the Fowley musket.